guys, good morning. It is Saturday, the day of my strongman composition, and I've been up since like 6 a.m. <laughs> it is now 8 a.m. and I am having some coffee. Um, my weight's looking good. Um, I was a little bit worried this week because I had been dipping really low in my weight class and then I went back up and I was like, oh no, am I gonna bust the weight after breakfast? And I don't think I will. So things should be fine on that front. And as always, um, sorry for the TMI, but I tend to get nervous poops before big events. So <laughs> that means that I will not be worried about my weight because there's a possibility of me losing a lot of weight very fast, <laughs> if you know what I mean. So um, aside from that, I was a little bit worried last night, not because of weight issues, but because my hips been bugging me. I know that I mentioned um, in my last video um, that I'd been sumo deadlifting too wide too wide too soon I guess we could say um, and it's been bothering my hip a lot so I was just a little bit worried that it would hurt for the competition and it would you know hinder my performance but I think I'm okay the only thing I'm worried about is picking up that Hoosfell stone I think it's a metal stone I don't know exactly what the equipment looks like but I know that I have to pick it up off the ground in a deeper squat so that might hurt a little bit, but I figure I'll just get it up, walk around with it, and just that, that'll be it. And other than that, I think, I think it should be fine. Maybe the log clean and press will be an issue, but I don't think I'll get that many reps anyway, so eh. At this point, I just want to have a good time. I, I know I'm not going to place. I know I'm not going to be the best performer in there because I'm new and this is a new sport for me and I'm not that strong. I mean, I'm strong. I'm just not that strong. <laughs> You'll see what I mean when you see the other competitors. So today, goal number one, have fun. Um, easier said than done, especially when you're, you get kind of nervous. Um, but that's my goal number one. Have fun. Keep smiling. Have a good day. Goal number two will be to do my best and have a very short memory with each event, meaning that if something goes wrong or if something goes right, move on to the next event. Don't keep that in your brain, don't stew over it, just keep going. So those are my two goals for the day. Hopefully I will keep myself in check, but um, so far so good. So now I'm gonna finish getting ready and I'm gonna meet up with my friend Victoria and then we'll be on our way. By the way, I almost forgot to mention, my parents are coming to this event and my dad will be filming it um, for me. I'm so grateful that my parents still want to watch all the things I do even though I am 28 years old. Um, I know that some parents kind of gave up after their kids stopped going to school, um, but in my case, they've been to all my plays, they've been to all my music shows, and now all my competitive athletic things that I do. So thank you parents, thank you mom, this is Mother's Day weekend, I realize. So, Thank you guys for being there. I really appreciate it.
so this happened. <laughs> Have you ever had one of those moments in your life when you're, you kind of just tried something new and everything kind of worked out way better than expected? This right here would represent that moment for me. Um, and also this giant bruise right here. <laughs> and also this one and all the other ones. I am so amazed that I even placed in this competition. Um, it is now Monday, by the way. Um, I'm, I needed a few days to recompose and not die because my body has been very, very sore and I've been very, very tired. So um, sorry if I didn't post this on the Monday. Um, I needed to chill and recoup and even just make sense of the fact that I fucking placed on the podium. What the hell? <laughs> Seriously, up until like that period where you wait after all the events are over and they're tallying up the scores, I did not know that I was going on the podium. Um, I guess I should have known, but I just kind of, because there were two girls, there were four girls in my category, and there were two girls battling for first who were more experienced, and then there was me and Steph, um, one of the owners of my gym, and we kind of battled it out, but I didn't really know, I didn't really figure out the points or whatever, and I just wanted to play <laughs> basically i came to party so she looked at me after we were done doing the events and we're just sitting around waiting and she goes you're gonna podium and i was like what <laughs> so that happened i'm very very proud of myself i am especially proud of accomplishing my mission that i set out to do uh, my two goals which were to have fun I had loads of fun and I kept a smile on my face and I focused on what I could control and I don't remember what the other one was but I'm pretty sure I nailed it. <laughs> so yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was probably really long because my dad took so many clips. Thank you again dad for doing that. Um, you're amazing. I love you and I'm so glad that my parents came to see me even though I am a grown-up and I should be doing better things with my life maybe but this was pretty cool I have to say. Um, I'm definitely definitely doing strongman again. Probably competing again for sure. Um, yeah I guess this is a new beginning huh? Thanks again for watching guys and I will see you next week. Bye!